that I'm really sure. Right, red is the colour of this notebook, as well as my preferred Rizzlers and the colour of a few of my favourite al albums. I see it when I'm angry and I become it when I'm smitten. Late night sauces on kebabs and lipstick kisses on filthy elevated mirrors. Orange is pretty rad because it spends some time chilling by itself. Couldn't really think of a word to rhyme with it unless you kind of say door hinge is the right thing, or porridge, or storage. This is some others there, Eminem did a video about it. Yellow, I'd say, is one of my favourite colours. I don't know where, but maybe in like the top three. It's what I like to say when I pick up the phone, like, yellow? <laughs> Green's a pretty chill colour. We've been hanging out for a few years. I don't really rate crisps that come in green packets, though. It's, it's always the shit flavours, like cheese and onion, isn't it? <laughs> Blue probably had the biggest influence on me growing up. Once in history class, I got a massive blob of blue tack stuck on my head. I was ready to just accept my fate as a modern trendsetter until I ripped it out and my hair was uneven for like two weeks. Indigo isn't really much, but it's cool to think that somewhere there's an alternate universe where the rainbow only has six colours because they were smart and counted indigo as blue for fuck's sake. <laughs> and that brings us to violet. A colour that may not necessarily be my favourite, but still one I can respect. Stylish, fruity, mysterious. Whether it be some fresh suede trainers or a reliable alcoholic beverage, you know it's a safe choice. It's your favourite colour's favourite colour. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah.